Hi folks, today I'm going to make a few of these little salt pots. As you can see, they're on about a 45 degree angle because they're, they're actually flattened. So, I'll make some of those. Quite satisfying to make when you're plonking them down on the table. So I'll show you making them and turning them to get them round at the bottom. But just a quick unglazed on the inside salt pot to keep the salt dry. So, we'll get on and make some of these. Using a small bowl of clay, probably about 12 to 14 ounces. So I'm centering it quite upright. I'm just going to throw a little bit of a cylinder first. almost round at the bottom I'm just going to squeeze it right in at the bottom so it's very narrow just take this out of my pocket and then I'm just going to form a little spherical thing we're pushing down at the bottom and then just stretching it out It's almost round, but you can make it almost perfectly round tomorrow by uh, when I trim it, and I'll show you how we do that. So I'll just make a few of these now, and then uh, I'll show you how they're finished off tomorrow. So that's just a little round thing. You can see it's quite rounded off at the bottom. So that's another one, like I said, dead narrow at the bottom. So what I'll do tomorrow, I'll show you how we turn them, trim, trim them, get them nice and perfectly round at the bottom, and then how they're flattened so that they sit flat on the table. So we'll do that tomorrow. All right, folks, I'll just show you how we trim these, turn these, just to try and get them nice and round on the bottom. So what I'm gonna do first, I'm just gonna put a little detail in that band of cobalt on just to give it a bit of blue and then I'm going to try and undercut this as much as I can at the bottom So 
So as you can see, it's not perfectly round at all. But what you can do is just roll it about on the back like so. And that virtually rounds it off, as you can see. So when it's flattened, it looks quite round on the bottom. Oh, nearly knocked it off. Put my wrong glasses on, can't see. So I'll just do another couple of these and then I'll show you how we flatten them. That's the most satisfying part of this operation. And the colour on it. And then again, just gonna roll the bottom around while it's still quite soft. And as you can see, just about rounds it off at the bottom. So I'll do one more and then I'll just. Uh, Chuck a few on the table, show you how easy it is to flatten them. That's another one done. So right now to the fun part. I'll show you how we flatten them. Alright then folks, now comes the fun part. It's just a matter of flopping them down like that. Like I said, it's quite satisfying. <laughs> So there we go, that's how we flatten the, the salt pots and they'll dry like that. So then when they glaze they'll still keep the when they fire they'll keep the same shape. So then when you get your salt in, you can just put your sat your hand in or your spoon in, and unglaze in the middle, unglaze on the outside to keep your salt dry. So that's just a few little salt jars.